Okay, so we've cut out this gnome with the Maslow, and we're going to use it as a template uh, with the plasma cutter to then cut this sheet of steel to hopefully get a fun little garden gnome shape um, out of this steel. Obviously, you usually can't attach a plasma cutter to Maslow and cut steel, but we wanted to try this new idea of templating something out of wood and then using that to cut a shape that otherwise you wouldn't be able to cut with steel on Maslow. Um, just a warning, I'm pretty novice at using the plasma cutter, so I'm not sure how well this is going to turn out, but I think for those people that are more practiced at using the plasma cutter, it's a really good way to probably get a shape that you otherwise wouldn't be able to get. We cut a couple of gnomes and I think they came out really well. Um, we realized that the template was a little bit of a difficult template to follow. Obviously you can see these spots where there's the fingers and all these inner body parts were just a little bit difficult with the um, plasma cutter to really get a clean line, whereas places like the hat it was a lot easier. Um, so like I said, I'm not very practiced at this, so I imagine someone who was better at handling the plasma cutter could probably make even cleaner cuts. Um, but I would say this definitely works using a wooden template to cut something out of steel with the plasma cutter, and it was a ton of fun. I'm like trying to hold them on my hands, like, nerd. <laughs> Fucking nailed it. Rage and gnome. Uh, <laughs> it's cute because it looks like they're like holding hands. <laughs> gnome bloopers. <laughs>